I addressed this convention. You met my two little girls. Fill me with pride. You fell for my brilliance. Made me a better father and a better man. Uh, I know. The same cannot be said for me. My girls remind me all the time. Changed so much, Daddy. I, I was so young that first time in Boston. Look, I'll, I'll, I'll admit it. Maybe I was a little nervous. I was filled with faith that made my story. I stand before almost two terms as your president. I am more optimistic. How could I not be? We've achieved together. We declared that healthcare in America is not a privilege. We finally began to wean ourselves. We doubled our production. We brought more of our troops home and we delivered justice to Osama bin Laden. We shut down Iran's nuclear weapons. We opened up a new chapter with the people of Cuba. We put policies in place to help students than it was when we started. I've insisted that we wouldn't meet all of our challenges in one term. I'm here to tell you we've still got more work. We're not done. And that is not the America I know. The America I know, the America I know as I've traveled, as I've rejoiced, but I have also seen. I see people, I see people, I see engineers, I see a, I see Americans, that's what I see. The America I know, let me tell you, Hillary and I were, we battled, let me tell you, I was worn out. She was doing everything I was doing. I thought I might have, I thought I might have, I asked Hillary to join my team, my staff, neither of them. I had, I came to realize, I understood, trust me, I know, but I promise you, when we keep at it, when we change enough minds, when we deliver enough votes, we've got to engage, we've got to reach out, yes, I can. You got me think, story I told you, my Kansas grandparents, they taught me, my grandparents, and my grandparents are kids. My grandparents, my mother, my grandparents, half Kenyan grandson. My grandparents taught me. I have confidence as I leave this stage tonight. My time in this office, there's still so much I want to do. The tough lessons I've had to learn, where I've fallen short. I've told Hillary, and I'll tell you, picked me back up. The letter I keep on my wall urged me to keep fighting the painting I keep in my private office, given to me by her parents so I wouldn't forget. He disagreed with me on everything. I try to be a good day, to salute and shake my hand. I didn't really understand. I am so proud. You've picked me up, and I hope sometimes I picked you up too. I ask you to do for Hillary Clinton what you did for me. I ask you to carry her the same way you carried me. You're who I was talking about when I talked about hope. My dogged faith in our future. Now I'm ready to pass the baton. 